I'm healthy now, tough point straight after the fight, a bit of concussion and you know, I've never kind of felt hard before in my career. First time I've been knocked out unconscious from my uh, but like I say, dust yourself down go again. We've, we're not been a good time for Montreal, mate. Um, I'm honest, I'm honest person, I'll say how it is. Uh, it's taken me years and years and years since I was a child to work to work to this point. Uh, fair enough of, if I've been beat by the bear man, which like I say is under investigation, then that's fair enough. I thought it was special, I thought it was special fight on the night. If it comes back that he is guilty, then it's kind of... Uh, Bit of, a, bit of a down point, isn't it, really? Like I said, I've worked that long to to uh, have it ripped away from me, unfairly, if you like. But we'll, we'll see. We'll just see what comes out and take it from there. I'm not going to say anything else on the matter for the time being. Uh, it's under investigation and he's innocent until proven guilty. Jason's last fight against Zaloni Tete, very, uh, not a very good experience. Uh, never been in that situation before. So it's been pretty difficult to kind of like look to any other trainers or anyone else for advice and things like that because I don't think many other people have been through that experience before. Uh, it was a very confusing experience as well because on the night I were like, Tete, what, what a phenomenal fighter. It's just, Jason looked really, really good going into that fight but Tete just made him look bang average and uh, I don't think Jason really had a second of that fight what went in his favour so it was disheartening but you had to give praise to Tete but then fast forward five months why it's took five months I've no idea I think more needs to be looked into to that as to why uh, it's taken five months for it to be revealed that he uh, tested positive for PEDs. It is what it is, isn't it? I'm still here now. I'm still here now. I'm still going to come back. I'm going to win and I'm going to be a champion again. That's just my mentality. That's just how I am. Uh, there's probably people around me, close to me, that this day fight now, it's still bothering them more than it probably does me. But I'm just like, I just need to put it behind me. I need to put it behind me. It won't be forgotten about after this next one, but it'll kind of... You know, it moves me, puts me back in a good position. Obviously, I should get a world ranking from this next fight as well. Uh, and like I said, we'll come back to a championship fight against a good opponent. I don't want, you know, I just don't want to be getting in there with anyone, a journeyman or anything like that. So I've got the news now, March 25th, that's when I'm going to be back. Um, yeah, just working away quietly, ready to put things right. Uh, and like I say, it's not finished yet. Like I, say, I think these sponsors have got involved. Uh, they're kind of enjoying the ride as well. And uh, yeah, all being well, they'll be back on board. And, we go again uh, March 25th. Chasing the Iceman Cunningham!